Hey everybody, welcome back and another signing to update you on here. We're less than 24 hours away from free agency and yet another signing of a guy who was released earlier this offseason in Lewis Delmas. Okay, Lewis Delmas, formerly of the Detroit Lions, signs a one-year, $3.5 million deal to join the Miami Dolphins. Delmas will play free safety for the Dolphins as he did in Detroit. Delmas, when he's healthy, is a quality player. He did play in all 16 games last year, was very limited in practice, however, with the knee problems that caused him to miss 12 games total the two years prior to last year. So if there's one concern about Delmas, it is that knee injury, knee problem. But remember, he you did get him for one year, three and a half million. So we'll see if there's a value there with the way he plays next year. What I do know is, you know, the Dolphins have a free agent to be, free safety, and Chris Clements. Uh, to me, a big reason... The Dolphins' secondary was so good last year was the, the play of Brent Grimes, who they re-upped with a four-year, $32 million deal, and the overall consistent play of Chris Clemens. Clemens is a free agent on Tuesday. With this signing, you would think the Dolphins will not retain him. Guy missed three games in four years and was a consistent piece of that defense during that time. You know, Let's say Clemens commands somewhere in a neighborhood of three years, 13 or 14 million, let's say. I think he's well worth it rather than risking bringing in a guy like Delmas on a cheap deal when you have the cap space anyway and hoping he's able to stay, stay healthy, practice, and adapt to your system. But, you know, we'll see how the Dolphins spend their free agency money from here. But Clemens is probably a guy, if I'm them, I definitely retain over signing a guy like Delmas. It'd be interesting to see what this deal uh, and the effect it has on the safety market as a whole. Because remember, you have Jarris Bird and TJ Ward who are going to get paid. Okay. But then you have that next group of safeties in Dante Whitner, all right, in Chris Clemens. And also, you know, you have to include Lewis Delmas in that group. He signs for one year, three and a half million. What does that mean for guys like Major Wright, Chris Clemens, and Dante Whitner? Do they have to accept lower deals as well, or do teams view them as being a step above Delmas? We'll see here in the next couple of weeks how this market develops. But if it ends up that the Dolphins could have got Chris Clemens for near what they got Lewis Delmas for, just maybe on a three-year deal, I think it would have been worth exploring bringing Clemens back, certainly over Delmas and the concerns he brings. But make no mistake about it, when he's healthy, he's a quality player. To me, too big of a question mark to risk. Guys, let me know what you think of the signing of Lewis Delmas. I've been updating you on some of the signings here today. I'll continue doing that throughout free agency here, guys. So be sure to subscribe. It's completely free. Be sure to check me out on Twitter as well. And have a great night.